My name is Eric Busho. First name is spelled E-R-I-C. Last name is spelled B-U-S-C-H-O-W. And I'm a captain with the Ventura County Sheriff's Office. So this morning at about 1.10, uh, our dispatch center received a 911 call from a 24-year-old man who lives here in the neighborhood. Uh, he told the dispatcher that he had a loaded gun and that uh, he wanted deputies to respond or he was going to start shooting people here in the neighborhood. And he also told the deputy or the dispatcher, excuse me, during that conversation that uh, he'd been suicidal and that he wanted deputies to come and shoot him. Um, he was very specific about the description of the gun and said it was loaded and that he also had a knife. Uh, when deputies arrived on scene at approximately 1.15, um, they were on scene for a matter of seconds when there was a confrontation and uh, a deputy involved shooting. So the 24-year-old uh, man was struck by gunfire uh, and he is in critical condition. He was transported to a local hospital where he's being treated. Uh, we don't. I mean, other than this 911 call, I mean, obviously there's a, uh, an extensive investigation 
that begins as a result of the deputy involved shooting and uh, they're looking into every angle of this. So uh, we know that unfortunately uh, because of his behavior when deputies got on scene there wasn't an opportunity for them to de-escalate. However, he was on the phone with our dispatcher the entire time right up until the deputies arrived and the dispatchers did a fantastic job of trying to talk him out of this and telling him to put the gun down and things like that. They really tried to de-escalate uh, the situation. So um, it's just really an unfortunate situation for all involved. So um, our major crimes bureau is out here, um, professional standards bureau, and uh, the DA's office. And in any officer involved shooting, there's going to be an extensive investigation looking into both um, the shooting itself and, uh, you know, any policy issues and things like that. Uh, any word from neighbors or anything that might uh, give us a background or anything? Or was he living in this neighborhood? Uh, nearby, yeah, yeah. So, um, you know, one of one of the issues with this is right now we're canvassing and trying to find out if anybody saw or heard anything. So, uh, we really want people to come forward if they did witness this. Uh, they can contact uh, Sergeant Steve McCallick. He's a detective with our Major Crimes Bureau and he can be reached at 